Hi there, trombones. In this video, we're going to be going through the notes at the top of page six. Please make sure you're looking at your paper while you're watching this video, because it's going to explain it a lot better if you're looking at the notes that I'm talking about while we're doing this. So at the top of page six, um, you can see how we've got pretty familiar notes here. You can see how we're going in a downward pattern. Each of these circles is getting lower and lower on the staff. So we have G going down to F, going down to E flat, going down to D, going down to C, going down to B flat. This is what you should have copied in your part along with these slide positions that are circled. Make sure that's copied. Pause the video if you need to. And then let's go ahead and play those together. So G is fourth position and it's up high. Make sure you keep the smile nice and firm and blow the air very fast through. A lot of energy on your blowing. Play a G with me. Ready? Go. One more time. So that's where we're going to start. So we're going to go G, down to F, down to E flat, down to D, down to C, down to B flat. Let's play each note and hold it out for four counts. One, two, ready? Try it again. One, two, ready. So hopefully you're able to get each of those notes clearly. Make sure the high notes are high, the low notes are low. When you look at the next part, 215, 216, 17, 18, we've got tonal patterns here. And you can see what each of these tonal patterns are. Let me zoom in a little bit here. You can see what each of these tonal patterns are. So here we start on D. Now notice how this is D, okay? And we're skipping down to the B flat. So we skip this note here in the middle. It's going D down to B flat, then it jumps up to the E flat and down to the C. So in this extra set of tonal patterns, we're jumping all around. These notes all went sequentially, but here you can see how it's, it's jumping around. So we're going to go from D to B flat to E flat to C, up to F, down to D, up to G, down to E flat. And again, you're just matching these circles. That's how you know that it's a G and an E flat. Okay, so let's try playing those together. Okay, before we play it, just real quick do the slide with me. So we're going to go D, B flat, E flat, C. So fourth to first to third to six. So make sure you get all those movements. Listen. Play that with me. Ready? Go. One more time. Ready? Go. Once more, just to make sure we all get it right. Ready? Go. Now, on the next one, we have F to D to G to E flat. And you'll notice D and G are both fourth position. We don't move our slide. We're going to change it with our lips. Do it with me. Ready? Go. Make sure you bump the air up there, change your lips to get to that G. One more time, ready? Go. On the next one, we also have the drop from D up to G. So we're going to go F, D, G, back to F, D. So we're just using fourth and first. Sounds like this, listen. Me. Ready? Go. And again, look at the notes in your packet while you're playing them. One more time. Ready? Go. And then the 
last one goes E flat, C, D, B flat. We should be able to play that together. Let's do that. Ready? Go. <laughs> Those are the tonal patterns and the notes at the top of page six. I hope that helps you as you work on this page.